Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, please subscribe and welcome. And if you're an old time follower, thanks again for all your support. content and I was like let me try to redo some of the styles that I used to do on my natural hair on my loose natural hair and then recreate those same looks on my locks so how many of you remember this video it's like 11 years ago and I remember when I first did it like everybody loved it and it was so easy and so cute so I was like let me try that on my locks so here we go so first and foremost, I'm going to hydrate my hair. I'm going to use my Rose Hydration Mist, which is rose water. And I'm going to concentrate on my roots and my ends. And this is something that I do every day just to make sure my locks are staying hydrated. And if you are new to my channel or just new about my products, um, these are not just for locks, my products. They are for loose natural as well because I use them on my loose natural clients. And then I just like to work it in until I feel like it's dry. And then I like to follow up with the moisture replenisher. And, and that helps seal in all the moisture. And these both have the scent of pineapple. And so they're very subtle, but they... Um, just smell really good really it's just a nice clean smell and they absorb so they're lightweight and your hair just absorbs it so it never just sits on top or feels oily or way down it really just hydrates the hair so I'm going to section off my front piece in the middle I think that section off good. Let me get this. So this is the part I'm section off, and then I'm going to take some halfway into a ponytail. So I'm gonna split the back again. Um, in half and I'm not looking in the mirror or anything to see if the part is straight I'm just going to go by my fingers and see what my fingers say and I'm going to put this in a bun or I mean a ponytail into a hair tie And so after getting into a hair tie, I'm just going to take my hair and twist it so that I can put it into a bun. So moving all the hair in one direction and then working its way into a bun. And then I'm going to secure it with another hair tie. And if you have short pieces, of course, you know you can just tuck it on in. So then with the back section, I'm going to put it in a ponytail, but I'm going to push it over into the side and up. And then get my hair tie. And I don't think they're evenly divided, but oh well. And then again, just moving this all, twisting in all in one direction so that I can put this. Oh, I messed up. I'm gonna put this into a bun. So 
So then you should have the two buns. I'm not sure how it looks in the back, so hopefully it's okay. And then I'm just gonna take my front piece and I'm gonna have it up, but twisting a little bit so that when I bring it to the back, it stands up. So then I'm just gonna lift it up some. And then here in the back, I'm just going to tuck it up under here. And hopefully I'm in view so you can see. But yeah, just tucking it. And if I need to, I might put in a, a few pins, but it seems like it's gonna, that tucking man, it works, it, it holds up. So this is pretty much it. And this is how easy it was even with the loose natural. And it's just like a cute, different <laughs> updo. And I think it's just so cute. So what I'm gonna do now is lay my edges. Now some people don't want to do um, edges with their locks. I like to, sometimes I do like to leave it just natural like this. Um, but today I'm gonna go ahead and lay them down. And so there it is. There's my quick little two buns in a swoop style that I did 11 years ago. And I was able to recreate it even with luck. So it just goes to show that, and my whole channel, that was my whole point, is showing just how creative you can get with natural hair and with locks. Now, locks have been around for a long time and people are always doing something very creative with locks. But even when you have locks, Certain styles don't have to be so intricate for it to look intricate or for it to even look very cute. So this is something that you can do short or long locks, short or long natural hair. And if you have short, natural, loose natural hair, the video I did 11 years ago will show you how you can make your bun look a little bit more fuller. So that's my goal is to kind of go back and revisit some of my old videos and recreate them in my locks. So if you have a favorite that you want to see me do it with locks, maybe because you have locks now, let me know what video you want me to recreate and I will do so. Again, if you're new to my channel, thank you for watching and thank you for watching even if you've been following me for a long time. Please subscribe, follow, and like, and check out my products at prettydimplestudios.com. Bye.